quick search online will give you a wealth of information about dress forms, including blogs and videos about which are the best, and lots and lots of shopping results. Despite there being so many options, I did have to do a lot of research to find the right one for me, as I have quite small measurements, and many of the cheaper ones came in standard sizes that were too large for me. I couldn't really afford a custom made one, and I don't think I'm likely to anytime soon, but while planning some projects, I realised it was time I needed to get a dress form. After quite a lot of research, I found an adjustable one that was small enough for me and was within a sensible price range. I chose to order the dress form from a smaller UK company and was really pleased when it arrived within two days. Despite the look of the outside of the box, everything inside was fine and it was all packed up neatly. After a quick read of the instructions, I put it together nice and easily. I know not everyone is a fan of these adjustable ones for numerous reasons, including the fact that they aren't as easy to pin onto and that its adjustability has limitations. But I felt that for now this one was best for my current needs and will greatly help with the future projects I have. Once it was all built, I had a mess around with using the adjusters to learn how they worked, but then I did go back and readjust it all using a measuring tape to make it a lot more accurate. I then had fun dressing it up a few times in different clothes just to make sure the adjustments were right and that I was happy with the size I'd got it to. Thank you for watching this video and I hope you look forward to all the fun sewing projects that I have planned now I've got this dress form.